What's up, coffee drinkers? I'm Luke. And I'm Chad. And we are the Coffee Nerds. We'll try out a coffee, tell you what we think, and go <laughs> with some awesome trivia. Alright, so today we're trying out Lucky Jacks, old school. We tried uh, Lucky Jacks last week. We, uh, we were less than enthusiastic about that one. Arr, very yucky. But we're going to give him another shot. Now they yes. say pour. Oh golly! This time we're we're pouring into a yeah. It says nitro infused. Pour hard. I don't know how you pour hard. I'm just gonna pour. I don't see what happens. It smells kind of yucky. It does. Yeah, mine smells kind of good. Open minded here. We ready? Open mind. Yeah, let's do it. Ooh. That's not bad. It's not too bad. I kind of like that one. I think it's better than the other one. Definitely better than triple black. But, it, oh man. It's still bitter. It is bitter. It's a good bitter. Ugh. I like a little better. It's so bitter. I need like milk and sugar in mine or something. Yeah. Let's take a quick look at the ingredients. Oh, it's just coffee and water. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. Apart from the bitterness, yes. Yeah. It's good stuff. I'm going to add stuff to mine. Are you ready for trivia? Ready for some trivia. <laughs> All right. So this September 26th is Johnny Appleseed Day, the birthday of John Chapman, who became known as Johnny Appleseed as he traveled Ohio, Indiana, Illinois, Pennsylvania, and Ontario. Planting apple seeds. Mmm. Yum. A missionary, John Chapman, preached the gospel as he traveled. He would plant apple trees in nurseries and then built fences around them to protect them from animals. He's famous for scattering seeds at random, but that's more legend than truth. He's also often shown with a cooking pot on his head. That's also another half-truth. He wore it. He wore a tin hat, and he could also use that to cook with, apparently. Uh, but it wasn't an actual pot. <laughs> Very interesting. Yeah, and his, his apples were tart. They were more likely to be used for, like, cider uh, than snacking, um, which is cool. Cider's good. Uh, yeah. Probably the last surviving tree planted by Johnny is on a farm in Nova, Ohio. And apparently there's a Johnny Appleseed Museum in Urbana, Ohio. That's my hometown. I had no idea. I had to go there and check it out. It's not far from here. That's really cool. Yeah. You'll definitely have to check it out, take some pictures. Yeah. Some video. Let us know what it looks like. I grew up near... Apple seed greatness that I never knew. Some cider, yeah. Cider greatness. Cider greatness. Apple tree great. Mm. Even though most of the trees are gone now, I guess. Yeah. Well, uh, you guys should definitely try Lucky Jack. Let us know what you cool. think in the comments. Triple black. Maybe and not. <laughs> if you like really, really strong coffee, yes. I don't, I, I don't know. It's, it's not for me. Yeah, I don't know. I like strong coffee, and it was, it was too much. All right, until next time, hit that like button. Yes. Hit that little ringing bell so you know when our next video is up. And uh, go over to Instagram and check out what we got there. All right, this has been Coffee Nerds. We'll see you next week. Coffee drinkers? It's your pal, Copy the Cub. 
Thanks for checking out this week's episode of Coffee Nerds. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks. Bye. I love you.